In this video, we will review the new possibility in RM to have a stress lead envelope. For that, in the cross section in Modeler, we define stress points, but for each stress point, we define the stress leading result for this point. So, for example, in the first point, we store sigma xx for the two top points but also we will define stress point in the middle of the web and in this case we will indicate that the stress leading result will be to x y z data once these four stress points have been defined we need to update our model so for that, let's go in the main guiders and update the cross-section. Then transfer all the data into our analysis model. We have a schedule that has been already defined with different load cases. Creating various envelope. Let's run. While it is running, it's important to say that we don't have inference line for stresses. So that means that the leading stress for the envelope dealing with traffic will be only the maximum stresses that are observed for the different inference lines. While it's computing, so now we will go and see the different results that we have. Let's go in the result tab, envelope. So if you go in the top, you will see that there is a new possibility at the end where you define minimum or maximum seg xx. Let's indicate for which point we want this result. And here we have the different results. You have the equivalent forces during this maximum or minimum stress. And you have also the different value for the stresses. The same for the sigma 2. Here we define for the point 0.3 and point 0.4 and we have the different stresses and equivalent loads that we can get. Note that there is no other possibility to create diagram that directly here. So we cannot use it in RM set yet. This will come in further release, but you can still print with the possibility to store directly data in, in Excel sheets. So you can after create your own complex diagram directly from the Excel sheet. We can still review and display on our model. So, for example, let's display some diagrams on our BIM model, but using the result from the envelope using this minimum, for example, minimum stress lead envelope and display <coughs> both the axial force and bending moment on this different beam. And at the same time, so let's apply and have here we have two different diagram with these forces. And at the same time, we will color the, for, the faces based on the sigma xx for the same envelope and here we have a complete colorful result of what we want to see. Let's change option. Let's remove the diagram of the forces and let's color the face based on the toe yz value with the minimum stresses on 
0.3.